and joining me at the Karachi Literary Festival, award-winning novelist Mohsin Hamid, whose two books, Moth Smoke and the more famous The Reluctant Fundamentalist, are both due as films. You lucky man, two books in, well, eight years, and both about to be made into movies, but more importantly, Mira Nair has been in Lahore with you in recent days, finalizing the script of The Reluctant Fundamentalist. How's it been going? Um, it's been going well. I mean, she was in, uh, in Lahore and uh, uh, it was great to have her there. Uh, she loves the city and uh, I've spent time with her in New York as well. I mean, it's exciting. It's an exciting project. Right. It's a difficult novel one would imagine to film because really it is one long dramatic monologue. Uh, so, film of the book, how is it going to pan out? Um, you know, I, I don't know is the short answer, but it won't be a dramatic monologue. I think the idea that uh, this character Chingay sits in a coffee shop and speaks to some unnamed American for three hours um, didn't feel like it had a lot Consuming of dramatic Consuming Coca-Cola, yeah. nothing worse. Yes, exactly. It, 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 it didn't seem like it had a lot of dramatic legs. So the idea is how do you um, capture the tension of that situation and the kind of interpretive ambiguity of that situation in a film that doesn't use that situation? And that's what we've been playing with. You know, how, do you, how do you do that? More important, of course, you're writing the screenplay of The Reluctant Fundamentalist for Mira Naya, and author-filmmaker relationships are often very fraught, aren't they? Is it likely to be a venture between the two of you that may end in tears? I, I don't know. I mean, I think that uh, if it ends in tears, it's not because of our relationship. We have uh, a, a very good relationship, which I, I give Mira credit for because uh, Mira is just incredibly easy to get along with. Um, and uh, I think there's, there's a lot of artistic sympathy between us. Um, I've, I've never really felt uh, that fraught relationship. Then again, our, our project isn't yet a film. So uh, if that's the requirement to make it a film, then maybe, maybe we should be looking for trouble going forward, but hopefully not. Right. I mean, there can't be too much trouble with two Punjabis across the border working together. But more important, uh, when is the film expected? I don't End know. End of the year? Well, I mean, I think Mira would, would like to film it, uh, you know, in the next year or so. And uh, I suppose that means it would release about a year after. But, uh, but these things are all very much in her department. So um, I'm, I'm much more looking at uh, working on the screenplay with her. And the timeline beyond that is sort of uh, uh, you know, above my pay grade. And Rahul Bose, the Indian actor, option Hot Smoke, quite some years ago. What's the progress in that? Um, I don't know the latest. I mean, I think he was making very good progress. And then the Mumbai attacks happened. And then I think things went quiet for a while. Um, and I believe that uh, it's, it's gathering pace again. But uh, um, I haven't had uh, a more recent update from Rahul, so I don't know what the status of it is. Right. India-Pakistan relations again at a nadir since the Mumbai attacks. And Amira is very keen to shoot the reluctant fundamentalist in, in Lahore. Does that seem to be quite feasible, given well, the difficulties? I don't know. I mean, I think that, uh, uh, you know, let's see where it gets shot. I mean, most of the film is set in New York, so obviously most of the film will be in, in the States. But the parts that are set in Lahore, um, I think it would be fantastic if Lahore was used for those parts because uh, it's a special city. and Such uh, an evocative city. It is a very evocative city. And, um, and so I would love for that to happen. Uh, Tuba.com